are honoring our nation's fallen heroes this Memorial Day weekend. KCAL News reporter Tina Patel is at the National Cemetery in West L.A. There are thousands of Boy Scouts and Girl Scouts from around Southern California that are here this morning, and they are going to be placing graves, or flags rather, on each one of the graves here at the cemetery, more than 90,000 of them. Ian McLean is with me. He is a Boy Scout who's been part of this before, and tell me how special it is to have everyone be here and, and take this moment. So for everyone to be here, it's very special because everybody in this uh, cemetery right here, They've all served for us and, you know, given up their life for our freedom in this country that we live in right now. So it's very important for us to honor and respect all of them with anything that we can do. So this is a big thing for everybody, and I would say even the family members that have lost these people that are behind us and in front of us, too. And we are also here because you are working on your Eagle Scout project. You are trying to recognize specifically the Vietnam veterans from California with dog tags. Tell me about why this is so personal to you. So this is personal because my mother is a refugee from the Vietnam War. Uh, she fled during the Vietnam War, yes, of course, and uh, she is from Saigon specifically. It took her two years to get from the Viet uh, to get from Vietnam to where we are now, California. Um, and your father also served. Yeah, so my father served during the Vietnam War. Towards the uh, end of the Vietnam War, he was with a battalion of, I would say, around, I think, 105 total. Uh, he was one of the five that made it back from his battalion. It's so amazing what your family has been through, and I'm so glad that you're trying to, to honor them and the ones that, that they knew in those times. So thank you for what you're doing, and thank you for also being out here this morning. Yeah, uh, thank you, actually. Uh, this, you know, this always helps me. Um, you know, everything helps, though. You know, I'm really glad I'm able to do this for everybody, and, you know, I'm glad I'm able to honor these people. Wonderful. Thank you, Ian, so much. And again, the flags are going to be put out this morning. They are going to be here until Tuesday. So if you want to take a moment this Memorial Day weekend and remember those who have served, that's one way to do it is to come out here and pay your respects. We'll send it back to you. Tina, thank you so much.